Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to welcome you to another edition of 205 Live. We're coming to you from Colorado Springs, Colorado for this episode of 205 Live here tonight. We're going to kick things off tonight with some in-ring action as here comes the Cruiserweight Champion, Pete Dunne. Pete Dunne has been the Cruiserweight Champion since the No Mercy pay-per-view. Pete Dunne has been an awesome champion. He has defended that title against the likes of Neville and Drew Gulak. He defeated Drew Gulak last month on an episode of 205 Live to retain the title. It was an awesome, awesome match. Him and Neville had an instant classic at Great Balls of Fire. And when Pete Dunne won the title at No Mercy, that match was an instant classic as well. His opponent tonight is none other than D. Brian Kendrick. And here he comes. And his opponent weighing in at 174 pounds. The Brian Kendrick. D. Brian Kendrick making his way to the ring. They're not on 205 Live. It's been a while since we've seen Kendrick. But he is back here tonight. This would be a great victory for him. If he could knock off the Cruiserweight Champion. And what is Pete Dunne doing? Oh my god a forearm. Pete Dunne with a forearm. Kendrick rolls out of the ring. He gets back in now. There's a boot. Not Dunne gonna taunt. This is just sickening. That's a strike. Oh man. Went after that arm. Now look at Pete Dunn. Oh man. Went after the arm. Now what is he doing? Oh my god! He could have just snapped the arm of Kendrick. Kendrick might have to go get that checked out after the match. That's a backbreaker. There's a jawbreaker from Kendrick. Kendrick trying to fight back now and there's a drop kick. Go for a strike. There's a kick from Dunn. Oh, what an answer, Gary. Did you hear that? There's a kick to the back. Oh, man. Dunn getting up. Clothesline over the top rope. Now this fight spills to the outside of the ring. But Kendra just sent him into the barricade. And again... This could be the opening that Kendrick needs. Now at three punches on Pete Dunn. There's a reverse from Dunn. And Dunn sends him down to the floor. Reference that count of five. Iris whipped back into the ring. Oh man. That was brutal. Oh man, Kendrick's knees came down right on the mat. I tell you, that had to hurt. Kick, no reversal. Oh, what a German suplex. And the champ rolls out. Oh, there's a kick. Done playing mind games by rolling out of the ring. 
And Kendrick sends Dunn back into the ring. Now what is Kendrick doing? Kendrick. Oh man. What a maneuver. Could that do it? That's two. And the champ gets the shoulder up at two. Kendrick arguing with the official. He picks Dunn up. There's an arm drag. Kick to the gut. Pete Dunn. X-Plex. The X-Plex. Would that be enough? One. Two. Three. No. Kendrick got the shoulder up at two. Now, the champ going to the second rope. Oh, what an elbow drop. Will that be enough? One. Oh, kick out of one. Dunn can't believe it. Oh, wait a minute. Kendrick, the captain's hook. Will Pete Dunn submit to the captain's hook? Now done with some elbows. There's a punch. Uh-oh. Pete Dunn. The bitter end. Bitter end to Kendrick. One. Two. Three. Pete Dunn wins. Hit it on a two or five live. That bitter end. Not Kendrick straight out, I tell you that. Jeff could have counted to a hundred if he wanted to. But nevertheless, Pete Dunn wins. They're not on tour five live. Congrats to Pete Dunn on winning here tonight, and where is he going? He is looking under the ring, and he has grabbed a chair. Come on now, Dunn, don't do it. Oh, man, come on now. You already won the match. This is just being a sore, a sore winner. Attacking Kendrick with that chair. Now, with it, I know he's not going to try and hit a bit in on that chair. Oh, my God. Pete Dunn. A bitter end on a steel chair. Come on, man. Come on. Well, I hope Pete Dunn is happy with what he has done. Up next, Neville battles Drew Gulak. Pete Dunn attacked Kendrick before the match and after the match. That's just sad. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England. Weighing in at 194 pounds. The King. Here comes the King of the Cruiserweights, Neville. Neville, the former cruiserweight champion in this Universe Mode series. Tonight he is going one on one with Drew Gulak. Neville's not getting the ovation he usually gets either. His fans are dead tonight. I hear a few of them booing. Use the olive and be booing. But I tell you, Neville, he couldn't care less what these fans have to think of him.
Gulak's the one who's getting the booze. <laughs> Drew Gulak faced Pete Dunne for the Cruiserweight Championship last month on 205 Live. It was an awesome match, but at the end of the night, Pete Dunne retained the title. You know, Pete Dunne had a very long reign as the NXT UK Champion. He had a long reign. Will his Cruiserweight Championship reign be as long? Neville. Gulak. Referee reigns the bell. We're underway. Kyle and Elbow tie up. And Neville with a headlock. Now Gulag reverses. There's a punch to the head. There's a kick from Neville. Now Gulag pushing Neville. Needs to lock up once again. This time Neville has the arm. Neville with a punch to the back. I went for a kick, he caught the leg. Now Gulak going to the middle rope. There's a kick to Neville. And there's an elbow to the top of the head. Neville rolls to the apron of the ring. Now Gulak puts him back in the ring. Kick to the back. Into the cover. Only a one count. What an elbow to the arm. German suplex. One for a kick. Gulak got out of the way. Both these men missed with their strikes. But never with a Northern Light suplex. Would that be enough? No, only a one count. Wait a minute, look at Gulak. What a throw. Would that be enough? That's two. Kick out at two. Gulak arguing with the ref. Uh oh. Dragon sleeper. He has that dragon sleeper hole locked in with another tap. No, never breaks the hole. Look at Neville. Inverted Frankensteiner. Answer the cover. One. Oh, kick out at one. Neville can't believe it. Look at the look on his face. There's a strike. Another strike. Uh oh. Clothesline over the top rope. Look at Neville. Neville over the top rope. Taking out Gulak. Fans saying this is awesome. But it's Gulak who puts Neville back in the ring. There's a reversal from Neville. Now look at Neville. Rolling up Gulak. On the 4 1 count. Look at Gulak. Oh, what a gut buster. We got a reversal fest in the ring. Look at Neville. Snap suplex. 
into the cover. Only a one count. Oh, what a super kick. That could do it. This time a two count. Look of disbelief on the face of Neville. Oh, uh, Gulak, once again, what a wicked throw to Neville. Well, that throw put Neville out for the one, two, three. That's two. Neville gets showed up at two. Now, Gulak, perhaps looking for the dragon sleeper. Oh, there's a super kick. That super kick looks like it knocked him out cold. Now never going to the top rope. Never with the red arrow. One, two. Oh, but Gulak kicked out. I'm never thinking what to do. Gulak is back up. Oh man, fireman's carry front slam. Now putting his knee into the back of Neville. Elbow to the top of the head. Into the cover. Only a one count. Oh, what a strike. That strike could have knocked that dude out cold. And now, the rings of Saturn. The rings of Saturn. Will he tap? Yes, he does. Never wins. Hit around 205 live. Congrats to Neville on his victory here tonight. The referee raising his hand in victory. And what is Neville thinking? Ah, oh, come on now. Good Lord, this is highly unnecessary. Ladies and gentlemen, up next will be a battle royal to determine Pete Dunne's challenger. At the Raw exclusive pay-per-view, TLC. The winner of this match will go on to TLC to face the Cruiserweight Champion Pete Dunne in a ladder match for the championship. Here comes Mustafa Ali. Ali versus Dunn will be a great match to see. At the tables, ladders, and chairs, pay per view. We already have the Bar versus the Street Profits in a ladder match for the championships for the Raw Tats and titles. So I can confirm two ladder matches. The Street Profits defend their raw test and titles against the bar. And we're going to have a Cruiserweight Championship ladder match. Here comes Johnny Wrestling. The last time Gargano got a shot at the championship was at the Money in the Bank pay-per-view. Neville was champion at the time, 
and he successfully defended the title against Gargano and Mysterio in a triple threat match. That match was an awesome match. Here comes the man who dominated the cruiserweight division in my 2K18 Universe Mode series, Sin Cara. Sin Cara was a champion the majority of that series. But Sin Cara has not been the cruiserweight champion since. Here comes Kalisto. And representing Lucha House Party from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 168 pounds, Kalisto. I tell you, Kalisto. There's one person I love to see compete in a ladder match. Y'all can't remember back at TLC 2015. He delivered a Salida del Sol and broke a ladder in half. Can Kalista win this battle royal? And go on to TLC and get a shot at the Cruiserweight title. Here comes the former World Heavyweight Champion. The former WWE Champion. Former Intercontinental Champion Rey Mysterio. Can Rey Mysterio win this battle royal? Mysterio versus Dunn will be a great match to see. And this crowd just started booing. Here comes Tommaso Ciampa. Can Tommaso Ciampa go on to TLC and face Dunn for the championship? Tommaso Ciampa is a former NXT champion. Him and Johnny Gargano have had some awesome matches over the years. There used to be a team called DIY. I want to know how is that going to play out in this match. Champ for sure knows how to get booze. The bear rings were underway. 
Oh man, Mysterio just came down hard on that mat. Close on over the top rope and just like that, Sin Cara is eliminated. Mustafa Ali just eliminated Sin Cara. That's a chop to Champa. Now Champa puts Ali in the corner. He's trying to change the chops. There's a hurricane running to Gargano. Kick to Kalisto. Now Gargano with a suplex to Mysterio. Now Kalisto and Champa going at it. Oh man, what a driver from Gargano. Now Ali takes down Kalisto. And Gargano just went over the top rope. Mysterio looking to eliminate him. Oh man, look at Champa. What a takedown. Now Champa unloading on Ali. Now look at Kalisto. Looking to eliminate Gargano. Kalisto and Mysterio working together. Over the top rope. Oh, what a German suplex to Ali. Well, look at Gargano. Gargano is fighting. One for a strike. There's a reversal by Ali. Oh, what a knee. There's a suplex. Now Mysterio with another one. Paying a little tribute to Eddie Guerrero here. With the three amigos. Ali is stunned against the rope. Someone could just easily the close on him. But he uh he's alright now. There's a reversal from Mysterio. Now Ray with a power bomb. Hurricane Ronald from Kalisto. Now what is Champa doing? Champa! Oh man, what a knee to the side of the head of Gargano. There's a hurricane runner to Mysterio. Reversal. And now, Champa has Gargano. Looking to throw him over the top rope. Gargano's over the top rope. And now Kalisto and Champ are working together. But Gargano fights once again. Oh man, reversal from Ali. Oh man, face first goes Kalisto. Wait a minute, Mysterio. Hurricane Runner over the top rope and Ali is eliminated. We're down to four. Champa, Kalisto, Mysterio, and Gargano. Champa looking to eliminate Kalisto. Gargano close out over the top rope. Mysterio is eliminated. We're down to three. What if it comes down to Champa and Gargano? Which one of these men will go on to TLC and face Pete Dunne for the championship? Uh, Kalisto, Kalisto with the Listo kick. Now Gargano with the Northern Light suplex. That's a jawbreaker. Oh, uh, Kalisto. Salida del Sol. Salida del Sol to Gargano. Now Champa. Puts Kalisto against the ropes. Champa looking to eliminate Kalisto. Will Kalisto be eliminated? Champa trying to push him out. Kalisto's fighting though. 
And Kalisto is back in. And there's a reversal from Champa. Over the top rope goes Champa. And Champa hangs on. He rolls back in the ring. Oh man, right to the leg. Went for a kick. Oh man, down goes Kalisto. Now Champa taunting. Went for a kick. And Kalisto with a close now over the top rope and Champa is eliminated. Champa was just standing there. And Kalisto took advantage. There's a knee from Gargano. Which one of these two men will go on to TLC to compete for the Cruiserweight Championship against Pete Dunn? Will it be Johnny Gargano or will it be Kalisto? Uh, Kalisto with the Listo kick. Kalisto could be closing in. I'm getting a shot at the title. Wait, there's a punch from Gargano. Another punch. Close out over the top rope. Kalisto is eliminated. Gargano wins. So the stage is set for TLC. Johnny Gargano versus Pete Dunne in a ladder match. For the Cruiserweight Championship. Can Johnny Gargano finally capture the title at TLC? That should be a great match at the tables, ladders, and chairs pay-per-view. Congrats to Johnny Gargano on winning this match. Ladies and gentlemen, I really hope you all have enjoyed the show. This is Legend Davis number one saying good night from Colorado Springs, Colorado. And I will see you all for a Monday Night Raw.